Hello everybody, I uh, hope you're having a good day. Chili Mango here and we're playing the Long Dog. So, let's get to it. So, we are starting a new run and we are going to try Interloper. Now, uh, my last Stalker run, uh, I was uh, Astrid, so we're going to try Will for this one. So while playing Interloper you get to play with two feats. So I have a few unlocked here, a few still left to do. But I'm definitely going to go for Cold Fusion. Gives you a plus two bonus. Just means that it might be the difference between you being chilly or warm. So it's worth it in my opinion. And the next one that I was thinking was this one. 10% fewer calories. I think that will come quite in handy, especially um, in this interloper run. You know, we are going to die, so we might as well accept it. Um, I usually play Stalker. I do have um, a long run on Stalker. Tried Interloper a couple of times, but I died the day one. So um, we're going to see how we get on, basically. So uh, let's give it a whirl. So I wonder where we're going to spawn. I know maps, but in terms of where loot is or where bedrolls is I don't know particularly so it looks like we're on Paul and Muskeg and it's night time which is not great so I need to get my bearings which way around am I okay so we're gonna go this way we're gonna check out this hide over here. Pick up cattails because we will be living off these for a little bit. So I th think the forge is over here, but I could be turned around a little bit. Oh bit close. <laughs> uh, cattails. So it's very cold as you can see. Minus 22. So we're just going to check out this here. Stone's always helpful. The book. Chips. And accelerant. And we'll pick up this one. My feet. So I'm going to try and make it, I think, around here. If we can find where the forges. I know where the bunker is so we'd be able to warm up there nicely. But it depends on whether I've got the I've right so spot. Cold in my life. thing about Fall on Muskeg, there is lots of cattails. So we will be living off these. And we will be um, doing the starvation method, especially to begin, which um, for those of you who don't know, it's where you don't eat during the day and then you eat enough while you're sleeping 
to get your condition back. So you may lose a bit of condition during the day. But it's not a lot. And here come the wolves. So we're gonna just try and go around those. Avoid them. We've got our stones, but I don't think they'll help us too much. Now, let's go this way. Because I definitely don't want to break through and get hypothermia. Now that looks like okay oh there's a moose if only I had a rifle hello mr. dog so I think there is is this gonna crack ah and get him to run away. Yes. Because we don't want him trampling us. So, I think... Is this the cave to Bleak Inlet? Oh no, this is just a cave. <gasps> need to get out, need to get out. Ah! <laughs> well, that's not good. That was very close. <gasps> oh, that hurts. <laughs> okay, so we're in a little bit of bother now. Can't run. Smarts a bit. Damn, mm. that's smarts. No, I don't think we're going to make this. I've got anything. No. Oh dear. Well, I think we're dying. <laughs> I told you I'm not great at this yet. And we were so close. Uh, if I just carried on walking. Ouch. Damn, we, that's smarts. We were where I thought we were. Uh, it's just so disorientating. Uh, that hurts. Oh well. <laughs> well, I did say we were gonna die. Sometimes you can put a fire out and it'll help you walk. That's smart. But that's not even working. Oh, that hurts. Well, 
Just shows how brutal this game is. <laughs> okay. Well, we tried. <laughs> Try that again. <laughs> no, interloper. Well, well, we all knew that was going to happen. So, I mean, yeah, let's try it again. Kept moving, so where am I? Okay, I'm not entirely sure where I am. We're gonna have to these. It is quite warm, which is nice. Now you can find out where you are by clicking onto your map and that actually tells you where you are but we're not going to do that until I have a rough idea of where I am. Oh, okay. So, we're at mine. So, oh, are we coastal highway? Are we desolation point? Not too bad. At least we can see actual places where we're going to uh, try and get some loot. And it's not too cold, so we're actually going to run. these up as well. <laughs> That's so funny that I already died. <sighs> okay, so... I feel like we are at desolation point. Pick up every stick we see. And then we need to desperately get some matches. Hello, Mr. Rabbit. Thank you very much. So now we, uh, we do stink a bit now, so we just need to be careful. Now normally I would scare him off and take some of that food. However, oh, there's another one. I'm gonna be a little bit more careful. to see if we can get up here. 
Because there's that wolf over there. Don't really want to try my luck. Be able to do a bit of beach combing. We can get up there. Now. I'm sure there is a way up here. We might just need to be careful and go around. <laughs> oh, I think there's that deer right over there running over there with that wolf, so we should be okay. That was a lovely circle we just did. <laughs> so hopefully, we get some matches. I don't actually know where the spawn is. Like I was saying, I don't know individual spawns, I don't know where matches bed rolls are, but we do need them. So I need to kind of stick close to where I know there are beds. And then uh, when we move out of this area, we need to just kind of strategize, I think. Come up with a plan, just to make sure we don't get stuck. So, I think as soon as you cross this, I think you're safe. Don't think we'll have any wolves attacking us. Nice. Well, we did a little bit better than the uh, previous game. I'll take a look. See if there's anything. Nope. In we go. See? And we're a barely warm. But better than being barely cold. Nothing so far. <gasps> Cooking oil. now yeah so like I was saying I don't know interloper that well um oh. nice stim brilliant see if we had a stim before we would have been fine would have been able to run and got to that bunker. But anyway, my own fault. <laughs> what have we here? Oh, ah, oh, matches perfect. Grand, so we're looking a little bit better. So there is a bed in here. Oh. So we can sleep. It is getting close to dark. Oh, Jerry can. Leather. Now, I've never really... F oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> uh, I've never really found any loot at the top of here. There's a book there, sewing. It's probably the most I've ever found. <laughs> it is pretty. So with it being semi-warm, I 
and the fact that we do have matches now. Just double check there's nothing behind that. Nope. I think we might run. I think it's the cannery, I think. I think that's what it's called. I'm gonna go down here. Yeah, I think we might just run to the cannery. Um, go to the boat. I think for the Riken, I think. Or have I completely got that wrong? Yeah, we're barely cold. Let's go out and check around here first. thinking I can hear a dog like roughing but I think it's just me now we don't have water but that's fine we do have a can get into here. Maybe go into one of those lodges or something. It's a bit windy, it's stopping me from die if I don't warm up soon. Walking too fast. So I can see the bear. He's just where my finger is there. here 
Okay, so no, we're not doing too badly. It's going a bit dark now. I could... Mum, I really do need to make some water. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. See if we can just get in here. If we didn't have that extra two degrees, we'd have been chilly in here. So it's coming handy so we can sleep here. Oh, let's just have a look. So we got a drink. So I think it's round here, so I'm gonna use a map. from a match. Hmm, I thought you could. Hmm, never mind. So oh, we need to make some tinder. Tinder plug. Good. I'm just going to use this for now. Just so we don't waste another match. Nice. Get some water made. And I'm going to take a torch. And while that is doing that, let's just have a quick look around. Right, I'll come back for that. Okay, considering. not. Alright. Well, we're doing okay. We've got food, we've got water, we've got light. So yeah, it's 
so we're doing okay. Let's have a look what food we've got, see if we can make a eat something and make another can. We can actually do this, which I probably should have done before. Yeah, so this was a recent change to an update before you couldn't do this by hand. Which would have been... Oh. <laughs> Me being a bit clicky. Before, you had to have a tool to be able to do that. You had to make a little incision before you could actually get the meat off. Um, but they've changed that now, which I'm very happy about. Because otherwise, the start of a run would be, well, let's just say, be interesting. Some more, let's just keep going. while we're waiting. Do that. In case we get bitten. Nice. Right, so I think we'll leave it there. We'll take that. Another one. And another one. All right. Perfect. So let's just go back up. Another little walk around. We're going to sleep on one of these tonight. And then we will call that a day, I think. Well, considering the, our first game, we've done quite well there, I feel. Found some matches. I think there's a Perth up here. Yes, there is. Oh, torch. Some more matches. We're doing very well. So, we will eat, we will drink, and then we will sleep. And bandages, perfect. Very good start. <coughs> it's not very good on the bed, is it? <sighs> right. So, we're going to eat. It's two, an extra bonus, ten hours, so we're fine for calories. So let's sleep. Oh, an aurora.
Greg, when you get this, contact my lawyer and fill them in on what's happening out there. I can't get a response from Deep Wild, and at this point, I don't expect one. Oh. Dear. Right, well, I think we are going to finish it there, I think. During an Aurora, we've slept, we've actually made it, which is quite nice. Um, what we need to do is obviously get our head covered and our hands so we don't get some frostbite and um, harvest this and then keep looking around for any loot and any clothing so I think that's where we're, we'll do when we come back next time so uh, thank you very much um, for watching and uh, I'll see you next time goodbye